Let's go for it. We no! gotta try, right? I oh regret it. I don't really? know why I regret it. Really? He was so front about it. So are we gonna... No! Wait a minute. He was way too forward about that. Ah! Okay. Ah. Yeah. Please Shit. don't look, Gabe. We're doing this. No, we're not. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? And, uh... It's the right way to play this. He already got this. This is such a weird. Really this is weird timing. I just want to be able to tell him in person. Oh. He'll feel better that way. I hope he can handle oh, it. I know he's good. Ah, uh, uh, cringing. Is yeah. I'm cringing. Here's Previously on The Walking Dead. No! You monsters! You're a piece of work, you know that? <laughs> Fucking Garcias! Oh, you, you... You shook my goddamn guts out! <laughs> Joe was in on it! We did it on her orders! I'm sorry. It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag. I'll help you. I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this. <sighs> Maybe he'll be useful. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I needed that. Come on, we have to hurry. Wait a second. David told us to come here. He's talking to the others now. Trust me, shit's about to fly. I knew I could count on you, brother. This is not over, Joe. I have friends here. Allies. Rude ass. Once again, man, you gotta stop hitting people in the head, in the back of the heads, man. CTE is real. It's real. It's a real thing. Damn, David. <laughs> Damn it. Strike one. <laughs> I'm out of practice, that's all. Yeah, same here. I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. <sighs> oh, yeah. Just holding this thing makes me feel better. Yeah, bro. You doing okay? Let me guess, you're getting the blow. Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey, man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> if you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. Sure thing, kid. Oh, man, thank you. I think all the other two options were get lost. <laughs> like, bro, that's rude as hell. Who do I make this out to? Oh, no, no, N no names. Band player signatures are worth way more on resale than personalized crap. Well, damn. Just your name is fine. Don't, don't date it or anything. <sighs> yep. This is your fault. What the hell is this? You want to make money? Get a job. <laughs> uh, whatever. <laughs> he's not a fan if he's trying to resell. Happy, big star. Bruh, Travis Scott just did the same Let's get shit. Back to baseball. Bruh, he asked a fan. He asked a fan if he even knew. A specific album name, and the fan knew it's nothing about it. Holy and he was, cow. he was, you just pissed. had to rub it in, didn't you? Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah, 
You should try it. Damn, man. Oh, son of a bitch. Strike two. Man, knock that shit off. I'm serious. You just talk, talk, talk. It's annoying. Oh, wow. Sorry, David. Look, it's cool you're trying to cheer me up. Really? I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, I'd avoid batting cages forever. Well, thanks for bringing me anyway. I needed the distraction. See? We all have off days. Come on, man. Don't start sucking on my account. Next time, we go to the shooting range. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. No. Nope. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> you gotta shut up! Stupid thing. My arm's throbbing. Oh, come on. Don't be a wuss. <laughs> I used to tell you the same thing. You did? Yeah. A little brotherly love? Back when we were younger. I remember I showed you how to play this game. Well, let this superstar return the favor. Watch this. Oh my god, the crowd is going wild! I got it. You don't have to rub it in my face. I'm done. David. David, what's wrong? Come back. I came here to reconnect. Instead, you just want to show me up. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. You've always been looking out for yourself. You tried to help me. Yeah, let me help you. You really want to help? All right. Drive me down to the recruitment office next week. The army? My job sucks. Kate oh, he's not even like in the military dogs. yet. Oh, I shit. belong back in the army. Oh. I had a purpose there. I had respect. Dude, g going back to the army isn't going to fix what's wrong with your life. You should just, you know, think this through a little more. I have been thinking it through. For months. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left... Seemed like that would be best for everyone. Okay, but I can't keep pretending this is the life I want. Not anymore. I'm not oh, gonna no. stand in your way. Well, oh, I didn't mean to right say then. that. I didn't mean to say that. I read that wrong. Fuck. I'm not gonna lie. If I go, it's gonna be hard on everyone. Kate may need help from time to time. You can help, right? You won't leave her hanging. I need to know that. In my mind. I'll be there for them, since you won't. If you want to go, you should go. <sighs> Thank you. I really mean it. I don't think I would have said that. I don't we know. good? Yeah. We good. Come on. Let's get out of here. To be fair, though, his mind was beer. made up. His mind was already made up, and I don't think there's anything I really could have said to change it. Get in there. I let you go. On the road, remember? Can't you help us now? Of course I remember. It's why I haven't shot you already. That's how I'm helping you. Joan's making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you tried to attack her. Hey, everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them. And that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this, but you've got to let Joan enforce the laws. You do anything she tells you to do, huh? Go along with whatever she says just to keep your place. It's not like that. Joan's got a tough job. She needs all our help to keep this place safe. You boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. This is bad. What are we gonna do? I never trusted Joan. I didn't think she'd turn on me like this. David, hey! 
I thought I had it handled. All of this is my goddamn fault. I should have seen it coming, but I dropped the ball. Big time. Joan lied. You couldn't have anticipated that. It was a sneak attack. I'm glad you see that. You may be the only one. I keep doing this, making the same stupid mistakes. Remember when you wanted to run away and re-enlist? Yeah, you talked me out of it. And you fought to keep your family. It's not you what happened. Do it again. <laughs> now. <laughs> That's not what happened. All right. Listen to me carefully. I don't care what's going to happen to me. I'm most worried about Kate and Gabe. They got to survive, no matter what. You don't have to worry. They're safe for now. We have to get them out of town. Both of us. You're right. No matter what we do, Jones already poisoned this well. We've got to figure a way out of Richmond. All of us? All of us. This time tomorrow, we'll be together and safe. You never give up on anybody. And I'm not going to give up on you. So glad to see you boys getting along. Armed escort? You're that scared to face me? Oh, David. I'm not scared of you. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not going to be a So pop, why bring the guards? Are you? I, I might. just want a calm discussion between us. If you try to hurt David, I'm going to be a huge problem. No, you'll just get yourself hurt. It's sad how we ended up here. But Clinton Lingard agree. You've become a problem. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. And then? Then you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. This place could have been something. Something good. And you ruined it. This place needs me to keep it safe. You set me up! Everyone's gonna see through your lies. I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. We'll debate all of this in the morning. Right now, David, I need to ask you some questions. In private. Bring him with us. You got a bunch of gun at me, bro? Get out of here. Ah, nothing useful here. Hmm. I'm not going to get up there from this bench. You know what's really interesting? So like is it it's interesting to see like how each different community in the Walking Dead uh universe is is ran completely different. No time to rest. Like you got you got this place, you got fucking Alexandria, you've got the kingdom you've got hilltop like all of these places are ran in like completely different ways and everyone seems to have like everyone seems to feel like their way is the best way you know well that's about the kind of day i'm having i just I know I just grabbed that pipe, but like, <laughs> I didn't really have a plan in mind of, of, of what I was going to do with it. That doesn't look very sturdy. So you just, you're going to use pipe on that. I don't think that's going to work. Could squeeze through there. I don't know about that either. 
I stood on this. Do those boards come loose? Okay. <clears throat> nope. <laughs> I hope I'm not on the time limit. That would really suck. I just looked at that. Where exactly my plan? But he's actually gonna squeeze through that? <laughs> I, I, what the fuck? Is it bad? I fucking. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh, Gabe? Where'd they take Dad? I don't know yet. Help me get out of here. These bars are loose. Help me pry them off. I can't do it. Hey, you Can can't? you help? Good shit, man. Nice work, Gabe. Now, give me a hand. Why was... <laughs> I don't like the silhouette that we got going on right now. It makes it look... It makes it look like something's about to happen, bro. I was, I was worried. I was worried, man. <laughs> What's all that noise? It's a herd. They're outside the walls. This way. Come on. You know, that is one good way to have a diversion. They did it to Terminus. Kate didn't want to stay at Dad's house. Where are you taking me? Eleanor found a place. She sent me to find you. While they hide out. Is Kate doing okay? Yeah, she's fine. And Eleanor's watching her just in case. We should probably keep moving. Proud of you, nephew. I can't believe you found me. I looked everywhere. Huh. Nice work. Thank you. They still got your dad, though. He's gonna be okay, right? Um, I mean, these are his people. They're just arguing, aren't they? He's negotiating with them now. You'll work it out. Let's just see what happens, okay? All clear. Come on. Kate keeps pushing us to leave. You have to make her stay. We have to stay until Dad's free. We can't leave Dad here. Not after we found him again. I'll talk to her. I'll try to convince her. Good. It's important. The fuck was that noise? Hold up. gone wrong here, hasn't it? We should be safe in this town. You shouldn't be a prisoner. People are scared. They don't know who's in charge or who to trust. I trust you, Kate, and Dad. That's it. That's Eleanor's place. We made it. Great. Let's get in there. I did not look comfortable. Oh, that was close. Yeah. This wasn't so busy before. What are they up to? Oh, I got a bad feeling. Come on. Let's get inside. He's also got a bad feeling.
ain't never seen a zombie get exhausted before. at me just shut up while i'm hugging you i ain't gonna lie this relationship's getting complicated as well i just can't do this now oh hey uh, oh hey hey <laughs> trip look who's here hey guys uh hey <clears throat> where have you been joan threw me and david in jail if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. <laughs> what is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? We've got to save my brother. He's still in their custody. And I'm scared what they might do to him. Told you we couldn't trust him. You were right. I'm sorry about what's going on with David. But we should have gotten out of here when we had the chance. We still need to get out of here, Javi. Let's go. There's too much unfinished business here. Javi! Sorry. We can't leave yet. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Look at that. We should have left when we had a chance. Now we're stuck here. At least we're all still together. Look, this isn't a glass half full situation. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. He's my brother, Kate. I have to. Okay. We have to rescue David. Damn straight we do. And we might have to face those muertos. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. The armory. Good idea. A small group should go. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Look, Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I about that... I I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on! Just 
Give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just I don't know what to do. With all that's going on here, everybody's feeling overwhelmed. Try to wait for the right time. Maybe she'll come around. This motherfucker's asking for relationship uh -huh. advice right now. Right. Okay. Good luck out there. <laughs> I'll talk neighbors. it over with Eleanor. <laughs> neighbors over listen to the door. I'll tell it. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on. Good luck. Stay frosty, gents. What's that mean? Like, stay cool, buddy. Looks like Bob's on duty. I'll distract him away from the door and meet you inside. Be careful in there. There might be more of them. Remember what I said about staying cool. I've done this before, Javi. No, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? <sighs> yeah, I think I do. How can we trust Ava that she won't turn us in? Can we really trust her? Your father trusts her. And we trust him, right? Yeah. Then we should be okay. I hope. How do you know when you can trust someone? I feel like I've never really known anyone. Other than you and Kate, Mariana. Trustworthy people don't lie about small stuff. After you catch the first whiff of their bullshit, that's when you cut somebody loose. Better safe than sorry. Makes sense. I think we're up. She sure is a big help. She about to do back there. <laughs> A little sus, huh? He just walked off from his post like that. Huh? Made him an offer he couldn't refuse. What if that shit went off just now? Ava said it'd be this way. down here the guns are through that door locked no time to look for a key either should we be breaking we have to shit do this the hard way i guess all right This is so loud. <laughs> Bro. Don't need that, but okay.
Put these in your bag. We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? Hell the yeah. uncle nephew one two punch. Yeah, we do. <gasps> Sorry to scare you. When we get back to Eleanor's, we need to talk to those people about doing the right thing by this place. I'll meet you at the entrance. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I legit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> she got a mean look on her face. I, I would jump too. Damn, bro. Y'all are making this so suspenseful. What's going on? Shit. Come here. I gotta remember to not take my damn hands off the keyboard. That's your only weapon. Hey, no. My man's Bobby, got a backward cap on. How the hell did I just... Are you okay? Oh, my God. I'll be fine. Are you sure? I'm so sorry. Yes, I'll be fine. Don't worry about it. We have to get back to the others. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody ah. sees him. I would be using my bad arm now. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility is right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. <sighs> okay. But let's be quick. Then like that sound. Damn, should can I? Can really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? I feel like I should have scold, uh, scolded. Scolded, I guess. Clem? <gasps> Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. <laughs> I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Looking for something? Sort of. I know this looks bad, but it's not like... It's not like what? I'm just here to talk to Lingard about where AJ is now. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. You've done this before? Yeah, I have. On myself, actually. In much worse conditions. <laughs> You'll be fine. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. Clem. Are you okay? I'm fine. I don't believe that. I started bleeding. I know it's a thing. Oh. I've traveled with women before and, and they all had okay. it. Alright. <laughs> what is it? 
I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It means you're growing up, blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. Your body is, is developing, and then you <laughs> things change, but it'll be okay. You should have asked Eleanor. Okay. <laughs> I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. Uh, can we not... <laughs> what? <laughs> Um, I'm gonna just go look myself, bro. Cause I'm not about to use, bro. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. Well, these could come in handy. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. <sighs> Just pills. What kind, though? I found what I'm looking for. Here we go. What was that? Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. <laughs> Think I remember how to do this. Please, please, please actually know how to do this. <laughs> okay, hold still. All right. Try not to breathe. I don't know why I'm cringing like I'm about to feel it. I'm good. <laughs> Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Water. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Even Ava would have to admit I was a good mom to AJ. Oh, flashback. This is after what happened. Whoa there, Clem. <laughs> it's just me. What the hell do you want? I know how pissed you are, Clementine. Spitting on David really got that message across. Believe it or not, I'm actually sorry about what happened. It wasn't easy for any of us. You have to believe that. I'm going to get AJ back. You can't keep me away forever. That's just not going to happen, Clem. Look, it's not much, but here. I 
I forgot about this, the finger situation. I, I just noticed that painting, the drawing. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you... It calmed him down. <sighs> this... <sighs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering? We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong, people can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen. It's dangerous out here, and right now, you're hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong, but that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. Or where you're headed. Oh, I'll keep fighting. You guys gave me no other choice. It's not time for that anymore, Clem. Your focus has to be on you now. That's all you can do. For me, staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone, or something, they're out there. And when you do, Life will be worth living again. From the first time we met, right here, surrounded by absolute hell, you and AJ were a light in the darkness. Hope for a better world. That's who you are. Promise me you'll never lose that light. Please. It's what makes you special, Clem. It's what keeps the rest of us going. Okay, I promise. You're a tough kid. Don't change. <sighs> I should get back before anyone notices I'm gone. Remember to keep the focus on you now, Clem. That was a piece you need off. a little extra support, there's an old airfield about 10 or so miles south of here. Prescott. There are good people there. I'm sure they'll help you out. I'll miss having you around, Clem. You're going to be okay. Thanks, Ava. Good luck out there, Clem. Okay, real quick. I'm really curious. I'm really curious to know what the New Frontier was like before all the raids and the looting. I feel like they were a good community. Um, but there is just the Joanne situation and the fact that there is a small group that's doing raids and looting that's bringing a bad name to the to a new frontier uh, because of that brand that they wear like you got a group of what 10 10 bad apples you know underneath someone else's orders behind everybody else's backs right okay you got these 10 people going from community to community really bringing a bad name to a new frontier like it's so interesting you would think a community like a new frontier they would want to be like a beacon of hope for everybody else who's out there surviving you know what i'm saying because wouldn't you want people to join that are looking to survive right but if i'm getting raided by you guys i'm not gonna i'm not gonna come come looking looking for refuge with y'all that just wouldn't make sense to me. So I, I'm really confused on like Joanne's motive with all that shit, bro. Cause it's a bad look, you know? And you got David out here taking the front of the blame because he is the head of security, you know? And everybody with a gun is out there raiding and looting. So that, that's, I just think that's insane. And I kind of feel like, I kind of feel like with this whole town hall meeting thing that they're about to have 
and them having David, David, you know, taking David away. Um, I kind of feel like I kind of feel like Joanne's going to try and like put the blame on David in front of everybody. And it's going to bring everybody against him. And this and I think that, yeah, I don't I don't see this ending well for David, at least. I'm a little worried. That's what keeps me going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. <sighs> so, what do you think? I didn't scream in pain, which is good. I think I'm getting better. Nice work. Thanks. Just glad I could help. You coming? I still have to ask Lingard about AJ. <sighs> Hello, Clementine. Javier. Thought you were rotten in a cell with David. Well, you can still think David straight with all them drugs. Got out man. Too. I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Despite all her pleasantries, she's a cruel bitch. Joan took him before I got out. I haven't seen him since. That poor bastard. He's... He's not getting out. Guess there's only one sure way to get away from Joan these days. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered, David was the one who stepped up. Took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than, than he's ever been. You can be as mad as you want about how, about how things panned out. The fact of the matter is, David's been good for AJ. Among others, Clem can be the judge of that. She doesn't need to be. As a doctor, I'm telling you, he's in better shape now than when I first saw him. That was because he was sick. He would have stayed sick too if I had listened to you, doctor. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? You put the damn needle down? What do you want? I... I just want to die. I want you to inject this into me. Mm. Hang in there. Tomorrow's another day. I, I can't. When your brother found me, he... He got me to care about everything I'd given up on. My life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. Without him around. I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. to know. I've been looking for too long. I can't lose him now. Not Bruh. I have I have to pause here, bro. I just I just can't see myself I can't see myself making this decision for somebody else, bro. Like I I I really, I, I want Clem to know 
where AJ is, but I I also feel like because we get AJ in season three, right? I I just feel like she's gonna find out at some point anyways. And I really can't see myself doing this for for this guy. But on the other hand, what if what if this game is so fucked up that me refusing to kill him now and him not giving up where AJ is means that we're never going to find AJ, but AJ becomes like a separate story. I don't think it's that deep, but I'm a little wait. Actually, no, hold on. It can't be that deep. I don't know if it can be that deep because didn't I'm thinking I'm thinking out the box with this because I feel like this game was made after season three so i don't know if i don't know if this game directly correlates with season three unless the definitive edition changes that i i don't i don't know bro i'm kind of i'm stalling really if we're being honest i'm stalling um i'm not gonna do it bro i just, this isn't my decision i'm sorry this is just it would be cruel of me to do this it would be really cruel of me to do this when I'm this close. I can't, I can't. Give him a pep talk. I know it's, he needs more than that. I'm sorry, Clem, we can't do this. No, I have to. If you won't, I will. Clem, stop, no. he's not in his right mind. You can't do this. Let go of me, I'm taking the deal. We'll find AJ, just not this way. There is no other way. Where is? You can consider the deal. Oh. No! Javi! How could you? So be it. It's your funeral. Especially now. Now that Jones rounding up all alleged traitors. You better hope she doesn't find you. In there, buddy. Oh, hey. Uh, hi, Clementine. Surprised to see you here. Yeah, right back at you. You all good? Yeah, we're all set. Let's roll. <laughs> mm, good to see you. Damn, this. <laughs> Sorry, this usually happens in, in movies. A little coming of age movies. Javi, you're back. And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. <laughs> Just surprised Clementine. to see you is all. Damn. Oh, <laughs> hell. Sorry. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. It looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. I saved this one for you. No, I've already got one. <laughs> Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. Thanks. What took you so long? I got stabbed. Dr. Lingard. No, I'm sorry. All right. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised he was sober. He wasn't. It's got to be a stressful job, looking after an entire community. He was definitely not 100% there. That's for sure. Sounds about right. Why don't you go talk to Kate, OK? OK. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Jones people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just cause they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. Hey, we can do this. Yeah. We've gotten out of tougher jams yeah. before, haven't we? I mean, sure, but this is different. We can't just cut and run. Not with the herd out there. Like it or not, we're fucking stuck in Richmond. 
Now, how the fuck are we gonna put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. Great. So, how do we do that? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. She'll be insulated from us and from anybody in Richmond who doesn't agree with what she's doing. If there are good people left in Richmond who are against what Joan's doing, we need to ask for their help. If we can talk to the people at the trial, present the case to everyone in Richmond, we might not have to do this on our own. We light the match, the people do the rest. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck. I mean, you could be. A big one that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are gonna be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? No. You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, you're bleeding right through that bandage. Things went a little sideways at the end. Gabe got in the way. A guard came after me and he stabbed me in the shoulder. Oh, I thought you guys were going to be careful out there. Hey, hey. Wait a minute, bruh. The, the option said I got myself stabbed. Okay, I, I had to, I'm sorry for the pause, but I had this issue in previous episodes where the option that I picked and what was said with said option did not correlate, bruh. The way that that was said, the way that that read out, it was, it was like, I got myself stabbed. Basically me taking the blame, basically me saying, Oh no, I got a little reckless. You know, I got a little reckless, accidentally got stabbed. I didn't, he wasn't supposed to say, Gabe got in the way, it was his fault, you know, and then I got stabbed. Like, no, that's not what I meant by that. I was, oh my God, I don't, ah, oh, that, that's, a, that's, a, that's just annoying. I know this game is, is, is what? It, this, this one came out in 2016, if I'm correct. So, I know this game is is eight years old, but I don't know. It's it's just I, I, it's this is me explaining to y'all. All right, that that's not what I meant to say there, and I and I hate that it's it shows Gabe noticed that with his eyes lighting up because now he's now he's gonna feel a, t a certain way, and that's not how I meant that. But eh, I can't go back either, so that really sucks. All right, don't worry about it. It is what it is. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, can you take a look at this? As long as he keeps Are it you clean, blurred out? it should be okay. Would you guys stop making such a big deal about it? It happened. It's over. Move on already. I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. I didn't oh, mean it that way. I have a bunch way. of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just give me a gun and I'll do whatever. Uh -oh. I know the town. I know what dad's going to be thinking. Hey, 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 slow down, would you? You're getting way ahead of yourself. Who's to say you're even coming along, kid? Are you fucking kidding me? Mm. Ugh, this is bullshit. Huh. I'm not staying behind. Gabe, take a breath. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than anyone else. I've got a gun and I know how to use it. You're out of control, Gabe. First the shit at the armory, now this. How am I supposed to trust you to do anything? How are any of us? Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to bargain with you, but you thought killing him would be easier. I saved your life too, in case you didn't remember that part. So what? You shot him. 
You killed him! What the fuck, Javi? Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, man! You let me think the walkers had killed him! You weren't there, okay? You don't know what went down in that tunnel. Exactly. You killed the one guy whose side of it I want to hear. And then you both covered for him. It was a shitty situation, okay? Oh, I bet it was. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Avi. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? <laughs> I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Well, maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We can take care of ourselves. Hell, we stick around you much longer, you'll probably kill us too. I'm sorry it happened the way it did, really. Conrad wasn't a bad guy. The situation was just... just fucked. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Didn't expect that to happen. Damn, bruh. Eleanor just switched up real quick, huh? Jeez. Come with me to get the truck. Gabe and Kate, you guys hang back here. Be ready for anything. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did, right? Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. Keeping watch is an important job too. Not as important as getting that truck. Hey, Gabe. Come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah. Okay. What? Nothing. <laughs> Gabe and I will be fine back here. Oh, my God. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> Did your name change? Or am I tripping? Oh no, it's it's a different color on my screen. I think that's what it is. What do you want, Javi? Wait a minute, why did you switch places? I know it sucks sometimes, but you've got to be a team player. I'm tripping. It's about thinking of everyone. I get it, okay? Just quit treating me like a kid all the time. You know, I haven't been treating you like a kid at all. I haven't been treating you like a kid at all, bruh. I've been giving you grace. This looks like one of the areas Richmond is expanding into. Too slow for an escape. Yeah, it definitely does. Guess they'll be using that for construction once they've cleared this area.
There it is. Let's go. What are the chances? I'd say about 50-50. All right. Smart ass. <laughs> Get the best seat. People keep getting pushed onto other projects. They're much behind. Hell yeah. This graveyard ship is killing me. What are y'all doing? Oh, let me get some. Early risers. Come on, we gotta hurry and finish before more people wake up. What are we gonna do? We can't start the engine. Not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. All right. It's gonna look like a light truck, you know? Ready? Ready. Ready. I just don't notice this big ass truck moving. Turns out you needed me after all, huh? I'm just saying, I know you didn't want me to come along. If I'd stayed behind, maybe we wouldn't have been able to get the truck. I'm glad you were here, okay? At least you can admit it. Yeah. Well, it turns out you're pretty useful when you actually follow directions. Okay. Hold on. I think I know what's going on. I think I know what's going on. And I keep forgetting the fact that... I keep forgetting the fact that David literally left him and never came back. <laughs> and like I was saying in the beginning... Like I was saying in the beginning, when we found out that David was here, David didn't really acknowledge Gabe at all like it took Gabe running up to him for him to notice that he was there and I think that this might be like this might be some some damn like I don't know I don't even know what to call it chowder trauma I don't know but I think I think Gabe is projecting a lot of these emotions that he feels towards his father right now and, and I I I should keep that in mind going forward but I don't think the story I don't think the dialogue options are going to play out that well um, I would like I would like to be able to say certain things like ask him about how he feels about the fact that we just found David and I, you know stuff like that because he I don't know it, it seems like he's really he's he's in the acting out stage right now and he's definitely like I feel like I'm not explaining that right, but yeah, he's definitely he's definitely acting out a lot. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I don't believe I that. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Try not to shock yourself. There's three wires. If it's Shh. the same. I need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. So you're telling me I'm about Just to sit here and hotwire okay? this truck in the middle of their yard. Oh, Alright. Toolbox. Loud ass. Control your gargles, man. That man waited his whole life for that moment. That's why part of your brain was exposed. Soft head ass. You might need that. Almost there. You might need that Keep screwdriver to get it started. Okay. I'll check on the guys in the office. Hope you grab that flathead. 
Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. Wire cutter should help with this. Right. Gotta connect the battery to the ignition. <laughs> All right. Am I am I learning how to be a Kia boy? Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Oh, it's just these two. Let there be light. You mean this? You mean to tell me that y'all could have did that this whole time? Shit. It's not that bad. In the truck! Let's go! Now! <laughs> you probably just thought we were somebody else, huh? Patrol went out and this forgot to close the gates. Away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? Hell no. I'm not about to turn the engine off again. What now? We wait for Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. <sighs> That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really takes you back, doesn't it? Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. You're right. This is nice. Like if I just close my eyes, we're right back where we were. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff. Not everything that happened after. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. He like likes her. You get it? Well, okay, I sort of am. I hope it works out for them. I really do. They're good for each other. I think. Think their first official date will be target practice? <laughs> then might be. skinning and eating a wild animal. Uh, right, nice. Young love. It's a bear addiction shit. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet. But to feel something that intensely for another person kind of like the best drug there is hey the falling in love is the easy part it's the staying in love part that'll really mess you up it's unfair that's all i'm saying that they're feeling what they're feeling right now and when that sun gets a little higher it's right back to the fight i just wish he could have had a childhood you know I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserved better than this. Now, you did the best you could, Kate. You kept this family alive as long as you possibly could. That counts for a lot. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time. That's what made the difference. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. 
you didn't run away. Is that a crazy thought? You could have. Never mind. But you didn't. I know you have your reasons. You don't have to <laughs> I share. Know <laughs> There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. I know we've had moments, you and I. And they're always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all. But before whatever happens tomorrow happens, I need you to know whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. Mm. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? Uh. I'd really like to know <laughs> before things get crazy. We might not get another chance. <laughs> no pressure or anything, all right? Well, maybe I should have stayed quiet. Let's go for it. We gotta oh. try, right? I regret oh it. I don't really? know why I regret it. Really? He was so front about it. So are we gonna... No! Wait a minute. He was way too forward about that. Ah. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Please Shit. don't look, Gabe. We're doing this. No, we're not. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? And, uh... It's the right way to play this. He already got this. This is such a weird... This is weird timing. I just want to be able to tell him in person. Oh. It'll feel better that way. I hope he can handle oh. it. I know he's got ah. on the pressure. This cringing. Is yeah. I'm cringing. Here's hoping he doesn't completely flip out. Considering we're about to save his life, maybe he'll cut us a break. Javi, it's an execution over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. What Keep a timing. All right. Now, don't bring the truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square. Shit. We got to get over there. Oh, now. boy. I know I clicked that option. I'm going to hang but, back here. But I really the truck. keep the walkie close by. Mm. We'll tell you as soon as we've got David. Kind of wanted to not say anything. All right. All Good right. Luck. This is it's weird. Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something or somebody. Like I heard, oh, that was my. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. What is here? Oh, there's like, is them the people talking in the background. Shot, or did she just have a little setback? I hate not knowing. I'm getting a little worried about Ava. Something must have gone wrong. Something must have happened. We're not going to know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. You ready? Oh, shit. Ready as I'm going to be. Glad to hear it. We're going to. the others can we for years now richmond has been governed by one simple principle strong council strong community but unfortunately the actions of one of the members of that council our security expert david garcia have put us all She's in lying danger to all of you I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. He murdered this man in cold blood. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless. Oh, is that Badger? This cruel? Okay. Not if I have anything to do with it. 
can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. Try to keep your cool. Joan's smart, but we're smarter. We just have to be careful. We can't screw this up, Javi. Javier! Oh, God. <laughs> I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why did you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have to say. Happy to. Been waiting for this all day. Then I'll try not to disappoint you. Whatever happens to the allies part? I had a very interesting really conversation with your friend Eleanor last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. She said you were coming here to rally the people against me. Convince them that I was no good for Richmond. Don't know how you thought you were going to pull it off. Considering it's all of us against the three of you. If you knew what we were coming here to do, why go ahead with this? Why put a noose around my brother's neck? This community deserves justice, and they're going to get it. One way or the other. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me. You're making a mistake. Ava! Oh no, they had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. So did Eleanor portray true? in a no-win situation here. So I'm gonna do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Joan! Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. If you're gonna punish anyone, it should be me, not them. So ready to sacrifice Bro, why y'all motherfuckers talking in the background? Shut Don't up! Don't worry, Javi. I'm not through with you We're yet. good. Hey, shut up. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Boys. <gasps> Come on, Javi. Who's it gonna be? Your friend or your brother's lieutenant? What? Oh, come on! This is fucking stupid! You can't be serious. God damn you, Joe. Bruh. Y'all really gonna. The right thing, Javi. How could you do this? What is the right thing? The right thing is neither of y'all. Where's the third option? Where's. Where's the third option where I like do some matrix bullshit and I chop Joanne's head off with my hey, bruh? There's no going back from whatever I do here, and I'm really afraid. I don't want to pick anybody, but I'm afraid that if I don't pick anybody, they're gonna take them both out. And I, I, I'm not even trying, I don't even want to think about the difference between the two because both of them helped me get here at some point. And I know Trip like is pissed off at me, but I'm not going to like spare Ava because Trip is pissed off. You know what I'm saying? And Ava has literally helped me out through this whole time. So like picking one person right now is just stupid. I'm not picking. I'm, I'm just going to like, I just, I can't make a decision. I got. <laughs> I fucking. You know what, bro? You know what, bro? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. All right. All right. What? Oh, oh, my God. Telltale. Tell tell you motherfuckers
Oh my god. Telltale, I, I seriously. I seriously hate this shit, bro. <laughs> you know what, bro? Oh. I'm not looking at chat. I'm not looking at chat. Bro. I'm just going. I'm just going to pick randomly. I'm just going to pick randomly. Uh Oh boy. Oh my god. And I just glanced at chat. Here's the thing, like Okay, I, I, I don't, I don't have, I don't, I don't want to pick this decision based off who I like more. Like, Trip helped me out when he didn't have to, and Ava helped me out when she didn't have to. Like, this decision isn't about, isn't, isn't about favorites. It's strictly because I have to pick one or the other. Or this right here is going to be my canon ending. And we're just going to skip to season three at this point and just go skip right over episode five. Because this right here, if this is how they want it to end without picking anybody, then so be it, bro. But because. I can't just, you know, just let this be the canon ending. I'm going to have to just pick somebody. And I'm going to be honest, bro. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply. And sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup with our own damn weapons? Something like that. I owe I can't just at let least it go. Trip. You've put me in a no win situation. I owe this to Trip to save him. So I'm going to do the same thing to you. Both of them Mainly deserve because to die for their crimes. I lied to him However, about Conrad. Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Don't! Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this. But they chose to go along with it. Is this the kind of leadership you've got in store for Richmond? Torturing people with your stupid power games? Justice isn't a game, Javi. It's about time you learn that. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up your mind. Boys? <gasps> Come on, Javi. Who's it gonna be? Your friend or your brother's lieutenant? Oh, come on! This is fucking stupid. You can't be serious. God damn you, Joe. Ava, please don't take this Do the wrong right way. thing, Javi. Trip has to live. He's invaluable. Son of a bitch. Javi, what the I... fuck is wrong with you? You're not I... making David happy, but I. <sighs> tell, tell you motherfuckers, bro. Oh my God, bro. How do you give me two options and the third option being my death and no, and no other way. And then I pick because you forced me to. And then you immediately have everybody look at me like I'm the bad guy. This is forced entrapment. I don't even know if that's right, but I feel like I'm being forced to look. <laughs> Respect you for sticking up for your own people. Shoot it. 
Wait! I said Trip should live! What? You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Betrayal. You can't do this! Oh, so figures. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. Wait! No! No! Oh my god. They really shot him. Oh, god damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. Oh, so y'all y'all like this shit, huh? Y'all fucking like this shit? I can't believe this. Have this some fucking balls. I'm this sorry for my bad. language. Stop her, Clint. Is this the process you trusted? No. Think about this, Hobby. You know what's gonna happen here. You ready for that? We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? You know Go what? Far away from Richmond. I would love that. It's up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody put your guns away. We're gonna handle this peacefully. Don't listen to them, Javi. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch. Take her out. She deserves it. If you don't do it, I fucking will. We're leaving. All of us. Right now. I didn't say you could go. Doesn't matter if you did. This is how it needs to happen. David, David, David. David, please. Boy, you're looking like Shane right now. <laughs> oh my god. I don't believe any of you. Take your deal and shove it. They're liars, Clint. All of them. One step closer and I kill him. I swear I will. Go ahead and shoot then. I warned you. They can't be trusted. Stop a second and think about this. You think Joan will agree to anything you say? You trust her, even for a second. You're gonna end up like your friend over there. I don't trust shit. <laughs> Move! Oh my god. Bro, can you have some better aim? Well, oh, now you're gonna turn. There that goes. This. This. Oh my god. I don't even like. Could this have gone any other way? I know if I had just shot. I feel like me just shooting John would have ended in a. Fucking hack! Get back Something here. way worse. Joan, okay, Joan. I need you to cover me. We gotta make things right. Okay. My boy got PTSD on the ass. You gotta get out there. Ah! He needs you, not me. Go on. Why did I say that? Thanks. Bro, you have not hit anybody in the head, bro. This is about to be a lot of people that turn. Shit, I gotta help her. I need to stop changing the damn buttons. <laughs> I knew David was gonna do something to fuck this up. I told you what he was like. When are you gonna start believing me? It's not even that, though. Below us. <laughs> oh. Oh, 
Wow, you're a you're a you're a dumb. Bro, you had the upper hand and you still wasted it. Wow. It's Kate. She's coming for us. Oh lord. Oh no. Please give me a This is episode four. Oh God! There's still Bobby, one more episode. Get over there before. Kate! Ha <laughs> 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 <laughs>